want to talk about sciatica. Sciatica is something a term you may or may not have heard, but it is a, a deep pain. Very, it can be a very sharp, debilitating pain down into the, the, the buttocks or the glutes, what we call them, down in the hamstring, down in the leg, even down in the foot. It's miserable. I'm Dr. Mike Jorgensen with Red River Chiropractic and Wellness, and we've had some uh, great uh, response and great uh, results with some patients with sciatica and low back pain. They kind of go hand in hand, but sciatica is a nasty one. There can be several causes. Some even, if they're bad enough, can require surgery. Surgery can be uh, a, a, the best option if something is like a bone chip or if there's been a, a full-on a herniated disc where the, the disc is come apart or it is pushed into the nerve. In those severe situations, surgery is definitely the best option. But in the majority of the cases, that, that's not that bad. Uh, and it's something that can be managed and even taken care of. Uh, so what we've done is we've found, we use conservative methods. We use chiropractic care. We use cold laser. We use, uh, you know, I've been doing this for 32 years, so it really gives me a help in seeing uh, what can what can be done to help people conservatively without surgery, without drugs and medication, even without shots. We're going to meet a very special lady who had a really nasty uh, uh, bout of sciatica and really got some bad information and was headed for a really bad outcome. But we're going to see where things uh, changed thanks to a wonderful person who referred uh, her in. And uh, we'll find out a little bit more about that. It's great. A lot of fun. Okay, we're here with Carly. And she has had a uh, really uh, unique situation um, and has had really some exceptional results. I want to uh, let her kind of tell her story and so you can get a little feel about where she was at. Carly, go ahead and just oh, kind of, how did we come to meet and go for it? Yeah, um, so back in November of 2019, I started getting really bad sciatic pain. And I've had it once before, so I wasn't too worried about it. But then it just got worse and worse. Um, to the point where I could barely walk or get out of bed or get dressed, put my shoes and socks on. It, it was just debilitating. It was There was no hope, and I was hoping it would just kind of go away and like it did before, but it um, just wasn't looking that way. And it got to the point where I ended up going to, like, the... Um, what the medical it? doctor? The doctors. I went to, like, the, the walk-in clinics. Um, I went... To my doctor and all they said was it's just sciatic pain there's nothing we can do um, I was given muscle relaxers at one point and that seemed to help but then they ran out and pain came right back mm. um, so I mean I knew something was wrong so I wanted to go to a different doctor and I wanted to get an MRI and x-rays just something something wasn't right you wanted to know exactly I, I just wanted answers really mm -hmm. um, uh, so I ended up going into a doctor and had x-rays and she had said something looked off so um, Sent me in to get a referral for an MRI Which I got an MRI and ended up being diagnosed with degenerate disc disease mm -hmm. at 26 and I was The ripe like, old age. Yeah, ripe old age of 26 um, But I kind of refused to Like just to kind of be stuck there mm -hmm. um, They told me that I'd have to have injections and that would be like for the rest of my life when I had pain. Um, and my first injection is not supposed to be until July 7th of this year. So that's, that was six or seven, seven months of still being in pain and just living with that. Um, so I kind of, we talked about it at work and my boss was very adamant about coming here and just say, you know, see if it works, see if it works. And I mean, I've been coming here since March? Is it March? Something like March, that. Yeah. And I think within the first few adjustments, I wasn't in pain anymore. Like, I, I could get up and get out of bed. I could do my regular routine. I could get my socks on without being in pain, which, I've you, you know, you never know, like, what you have until you have to have your boyfriend help you put your socks and shoes on. <laughs> like, oh. That's some, that, that's really, that's really crazy. Um, but it's what the reason you're such a wonderful example of this is because I think you represent thousands, maybe even millions of people who maybe their original care provider, whether it's their, their chiropractor or their medical doctor, you know, gives them the diagnosis. Oh, you've got sciatica. Mm -hmm. Well, that's, that's, that may be a, di a diagnosis that's accurate. It may not be, but it's like I tell patients, like, I don't care what your label is so much. What is causing your pain? What is causing mm -hmm. you to be so miserable? Let's get to the cause because I believe, like we've talked about, 
that we're programmed, our bodies are designed to be healthy and free of pain. Yeah. And uh, what's really tragic, uh, it's tragic and it's, and it's also it's wonderful, is that had you not had a wonderful employer like Don to kind of ride you and say, hey, what do you got to lose? Why don't you go and see him? You know, this is why we're doing these videos, folks, is so that, that maybe Carly's story can reach out and touch somebody's life. Yep. And, um, you know, I'll just give you a little, you know, a little if, if it's okay, some yeah. information. You know, we've kind of figured that some of this degenerative stuff maybe went all the way back to a childhood accident where you fell out of a bunk bed yeah. and maybe injured your back. And so it's like, wow, th these th people are going around with this stuff. And they don't realize that it can go back years. Mm -hmm. And uh, so anyway, you've just been an amazing uh, testimonial and wonderful story. I, I, I'm so grateful that you've, that you've come around and responded. You've been so wonderful with your compliance and whatnot. You're just a joy to treat. And the story is, is, is amazing, so I'm so grateful for that. And, and that you probably don't have to go do anything in July. Totally. <laughs> I, I'm going to cancel it. Like, yeah. It's just, the, if you're in pain, just just come. Just come right here because he'll fix you up. Because That's amazing. I really thought, I like, I was even contemplating not playing softball this summer. Like, I couldn't do anything I normally did. And yeah. now I'm back in, back in not being in pain, and it's... Pretty, pretty big blessing not yeah. to be in pain anymore. Yeah, it's amazing. You got your rest of your life ahead of you. You can enjoy. Yeah. Well, it's wonderful. So, again, uh, if you have any questions, you have had if you've had sciatica, you're somebody you know, love, care about. Give us a call at Red River Chiropractic and Wellness 701-235-2700. You can visit our website RedRiverWellness.com to learn a little bit more. Feel free to give me a call if you have any questions. I can personally personally answer. Pain Relief Powerful Health Naturally. Hope to hear or talk to you soon. Thanks, folks.